This is a demonstration of the wavelengths generated by the Laser Physics 300WC Argon Krypton Ion Laser. Uh, it's a 300 milliwatt air cooled unit. And it's not running quite right. It seems to be really heavy on the yellow and the red. This is at idle. And these are the frequencies that it's producing. So at absolute idle, it's producing heavy red and heavy yellow, a little bit of blue. The color is sort of kind of a peach color, maybe a rust color. The camera can't pick up the yellow. It, it shows the yellow as sort of a green. The sensors only are designed to pick up red, green, and blue. So as you can see, there is the yellow line, the 590, 580 line of the Krypton. Kind of shows up as green. So as I pull out the current, you'll see I'll go up to max current for a moment. You'll see all the wavelengths come out. But just for a moment. As the tube pressure goes up, the gas pressure goes up, the colors fade away, the yellow goes out, the green drops down, the violet and one of the blues goes out as well. So the actual color that you're seeing is kind of a magenta pink. As I drop it down, see other wavelengths disappear, and the yellow come back, and the green drop way down. So all the way back down to idle really quick. And you'll see just a very faint 680. You'll see a very strong 670, and the uh, Krypton yellow. A little bit of the blue. Pull it up about a quarter power. You'll see that blue come way up. You'll see the second ring come up. Pull it up to about three quarters power. And you can get a good balance. Now in software, for doing light shows, this would be a good mix. You have to drop down the reds and the blue, and you'll wind up with a good white balance. But that's about as quite close to white as I'm going to get. The tube is reprocessed, and it wasn't reprocessed correctly because, again, at full power, lines that just disappear. You get a really, really heavy red. One of the interesting things is the green. One green goes away, and another green comes back.
Argon Krypton Spectra. Thanks for watching.